Now we get to play as Patrick. See, I kind of wish there were more platformers like this. I know that it kind of seems that platforming is sort of not... Sort, sort of died off, but I think they could still pull it off. So I think I remember a boss that I had to throw fruit at and I just couldn't do it very well. I don't know. So Patrick body slams people. Patrick can pick up and throw tiki's, but only tiki's that aren't stacked. Okay. Oh, get out of here, jellyfish. So what does this guy have to say? It's a fish with a mustache. Nothing, he's just there. He's just kind of hanging around. I get it. I can get it. Oh, so that's how I swap characters. Okay. But I want to keep playing as Patrick right now, mostly because I have to. We need... Oh, I can throw that up. Okay, I thought that would, like, break it if I did that, but it looks like nope. That is, um... Oh, darn. It is timed. Good to know. <laughs> I was like, that's a funny looking watermelon? Nope, it just, it, you know, I get a limited amount of time for this, apparently. Okay, there we go. And... Let's see, this is a Patrick Teeter Totter. Oh, I get it. Okay, so that is what underwear is. Don't be near it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah gotta figure underwear out. fits quite right. Yeah, I wouldn't think not so either there, Patrick. Okay, even Patrick and double jump. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. At least we have a lot of money. I'm sure something will cost like 5,000 of those things. Barnacle head, watch where you're going. The rock is talking to me. Almighty oh, rock, I am at your command. Down here, you big pink lummox. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday. And now my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knock-off wallets. Oh, thank you! <laughs> the dialogue in this game is better than half the TV shows of Spongebob today. <laughs> Holy moly, that's awesome. Okay. So I can do slams. I thought I tried that, maybe. No, I tried to push Y. So Patrick doesn't have the bubble Ooh, Viking crown. Scary dark cave. Ow. Okay, so don't do that. I'm like in a museum of natural history now. What? I like attacked at the edge of the tiki and the tiki spun and I spun with it. That was weird. All right, well, I don't know if this is even worth doing. Let's see. What's the purpose of that? Do I even get those? Oh, I do get those, okay. I didn't know if they'd fall and then just stay there forever, but they come over to me. So that is in fact worth doing. That's much better. Spikes. So I don't remember the beginning of this game at all. This is all completely new to me. There are specific parts that I remember pretty vividly, but this part, nope. Not at all. Can't jump with this. Oh, and I tossed it all the way over there. Good. Checkpoint. Good. So far, nothing's too ridiculous, but we'll see. It'd be kind of cool if this ended up being a really hard game. I don't, I don't think it will be, but 
That'd be really cool. Ow, it hurts if I touch the sides of them, okay. And... I really hope Crash 4 is hard. I talked about that a lot when I was playing the trilogy. It's like, I loved Crash 1 because it was so dang difficult. Crash 2 was worse because it was easier. Crash 3... How many of these do I have to carry? Crash 3 had its moments of difficulty, but it couldn't make up its mind if it wanted to be easy or not. It was really weird. So I hope the first one is consistently difficult. Alright, so... Alright, there's something I'm missing here. Metric can... Oh, I can jump on the fruit. Okay. Guess I never thought of that. stack. Whoops. Hey, excuse me. There we go. <laughs> That's stupid. That stupid uh, cliff got in the way. Well, I'm not exactly sure I'd call that stacked, but... Did I grab onto the edge? Oh, and then I get to slide. Jump. Oh, wow, wow. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Ow, I jumped. Body. I jumped. Come on. Patrick can pick it up and it will free the goo. Okay. Or freeze the goo. And there's a sock over there. Oh. Huh. It actually, like, freezes the whole goo. Hey, this is mine! I wonder what those are used for, that I do not remember. Little fish friend, and this guy looks very unhappy. I might make that like a profile picture of something. <laughs> what is this fish's problem? He just, he's shocked that he's down here. They know they can swim, right? How's the little kid look? He just looks like he doesn't know why he exists. Okay. Why don't you come help me out, fish man? Oh, I, I feel like belly flopping probably does more good than it helps. I don't know. It's like it's too difficult for me to deal with most of the time. Ow. I actually got hit by an enemy. Okay, let's just clear out the enemies before we worry about anything else. Where's this take us? Jellyfish Lake. No, we're not going down here. Wait, what? I just killed you guys. Ah, uh, need... Okay, that's weird. Kind of annoying, actually. Does that break? Dang it. Why do you keep coming back? Is that it? Are you done spawning? Nope. Okay. So... I'm gonna have to somehow... Get this up there. Without throwing it on the stupid... Okay, what do you have to say? Oh, I have to pick up stun robots. Okay, fine. Oops. Hey, my back feels better. Oh. Ow. Ouch. Ouch. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Okay, I might actually die to the stupid robot. What's the belly flop? That's not belly flopping. Oh, I have to double jump. Okay. Oh. oh. Wow. I died to a robot. Yeah, this belly flopping is going to be a pain in the neck. Oh! That's much better. Oh! There we go. Oh, you're the one spawning them, I get it. Okay, got six. So we can go into a new area. We need ten, like, fifteen, so, you know, so long as we get enough to continue. Anything else in here? We came in that way, so I don't think so. We get, like, a map. Sort of. Well, that tells us what we've locked, okay, or unlocked. 
I've only got two here. There's quite a few areas. Flying Dutchman's Graveyard. I don't think I ever got that far because the bosses were hard, man. At least I remember them being hard. Maybe now that I'm, like, better at games, they won't be as bad. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Ahoy there! On. Squidward tells me you're looking for the king jellyfish. This is the wrong voice, too. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor! Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. I guess I couldn't... What was that? Tom Clancy or Clancy someone? I guess I couldn't pay him enough to <laughs> do the game. Actually, I don't know. Are these the original voices to the game? Or are they remastered? Or did they re-voice them? Is that tartar sauce? Oh, I remember these guys. Yep, that looks interesting, so let's see, what are your attacks? I have to actually hit you more than once. Hey, it's an anchovy! <laughs> I love that fish. <laughs> oh, this game, my goodness. Okay. Oh, I can attack in the air? Okay, Patrick is different than... Sp well, I guess Spongebob can attack in the air too, but... Okay, yeah, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> That's exactly the same. Sparkly thingy. Uh oh, this one goes boom. Okay. Hey, Mrs. Hello, Puff. Mrs. Puff. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for you to do. Oh boy. Yeah, that sounds like Mrs. Puff. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, you're welcome to it. Show sure enough, Mrs. Puff. What? <laughs> okay, well, um, I took it and threw it into the lake, so what do you have to say? Shh, tiki. So Patrick can't sneak up on them? No, but he can throw stuff at them. Okay, so that's how you get rid of those guys. So there's a golden spatula in the lake. Do I have to throw... I think I've got to throw... Some of those guys. I'm gonna kill them all on accident. I didn't mean to. Oh, come on. Ouch. Ooh. Why is a whistle? <laughs> wow. Robot go boom. I don't think SpongeBob's everywhere fits quite right. Oh! You have barely enough time to get out of that. Okay, where would I throw this? There? Cool. Okay. I can kind of move in the air while I do that. Not what I meant to do. <laughs> so one more building, maybe. Stay away, stay away, stay away. Stay away. More buildings? Yeah, one more building. Oh no. That's much better. No. I'm so close. Okay, let's not die to this stuff now. Stay away. Cool. That is another spatula for me. I almost walked to my death. So I guess we're supposed to switch back to SpongeBob. 